fashionistas out there. It is your plus size fashionista. Mm hmm Yep. So y'all already know this is a honey time. So get your popcorn, get your drink, get comfortable, cause y'all know I'm about to go in and let have. So mm-hmm. Yeah. Hey, all my fashionistas and fashionistas out there. It's your plus size fashionista. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm back with a hoodie top. I know I'm looking crazy, but y'all know I come made up sometimes. I come looking busted. Whatever. This is me. Just with brows on. Anywho. So it's like 7, 17 a.m. my time. And yeah, I had to report to y'all with this foolishness and fuckery. Oh, I'm sorry. If y'all do not like swearing, cussing, Anything of the sort, this video may not be for you. So that's my little disclaimer. So I'll give y'all time to go on. Hit the trail. Keep it pushing. All right. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. So y'all want to uh, proceed with this? Let me tell y'all about this foolishness and fuckery. Okay. So. I'm not going to put the company name out there. I'm not going to do that because y'all know I don't get down like that. But I do want to let y'all know about a lot of things that happen. And sometimes I feel like I get backlash because I keep things so honest and so real with y'all. And I get a backlash because so many people say, well, you're an online vlogger and you're not supposed to act like that. And da 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 da. I'm going to tell y'all, I'm a real ass person. I don't sugarcoat things. I don't say things, you know what I'm saying, to make you feel better. No, I give it to you real straight, no chaser. I expect people to do the same for me because I don't want nobody sugarcoat nothing. Tell me real. Yeah, it may hurt my feelings, but let me know. That show me you a real honest ass person. Anyway, so we going to proceed. So I'm following this person been following them for a while you know they you know all about you know the uh, plus size world you know industry fashion you know all of this and all that so i've been fat following this person for a while and they've been following me and they know you know i'm an online vlogger or beauty guru or whatever the hell you want to call me um so they you know so and all of that and they recently well, not recently. Maybe because this shit been occurring for months. But um, they had uh, contacted me months and months ago to review their items. And they um, make uh, custom made items like leggings, dresses, things of that sort. And that's what made me, you know, pique my interest and wanted me to do it. I'm like, because, yeah, you know, everybody has, you know, online boutiques and, you know, shoes, clothes, accessories. But what piqued my interest is you're custom making it. So it's going to be different than what's all out now. So that's what made me do it. And as well, you guys know I support any and everybody, especially my own color so she's my own color so i'm like you know i'm down you know whatever we're gonna push this out we're gonna get you out there we're gonna get you sales we're gonna do all that because yeah okay so they reached out to me months ago they contacted me right at first they wanted me to do a review on some leggings okay I picked the leggings, whatever, whatever, because I consulted with my boyfriend and told him, showed him, you know, is these hot, whatever, whatever. He's like, yeah, those hot. Yeah, do it. So I did it. Picked out the stuff. Contacted her back, told her, you know, what I wanted. She's like, okay, I'm going to get right to it, do it, whatever, whatever. Child, time went on. I ain't heard from the broad. So I contacted him, you know, you know, that you know. You still want me to do the review for you? Yeah, I'm going to do the review for you. But I figured instead of just sending leggings, I'm going to send leggings and a shirt. I'm like, my dumb, retarded, gullible ass. Okay, you know, whatever. Do your thing. I'm not rushing you because, again, when you hand make stuff, it does take time. So I keep that in, in account, y'all. I knew that. 
So I wasn't trying to put no rush on her, but I did want to know, you know, what's going on. Inform me, because I've worked with tons of people and they inform me of the process. How long it's gonna take, shit when they done. They even took pictures, sent me stuff, sent me tracking numbers, things of the sort. All right, I'm going too far in the story. Okay, so where I left off at. Okay, so then time went on. I was like, okay, yeah, so time went on again. All right, so then I asked again, you know, did you want me to do the review? She said, yeah, but I'm going to send you a dress instead. I'm like, okay, and then I seen her business page and then her personal page, she was posting different stuff. So I'm like, you know what, because at first, you know, later down after she keep on, you know, janking me and joshing me i'm thinking well damn you know is this real is this you know a scam because you know it's a lot of people scamming and shit so that did come in my you know my roach antennas was clicking like is this bitch trying to scam a bitch because i no we ain't we ain't about that life so yeah i'm gonna make a dress for you you know i want to do that instead i'm like okay so Yeah, so then again, y'all, time went on. So I'm like, you know, I had forgot about it this time, honestly, because y'all know I do so much. But this time, I forgot. But then I'm like, okay, you know, she going to send it? So I emailed her, like, not too long ago. And then, like, maybe 30, 45 minutes ago, I emailed her. Then she was like, well, I'm doing a fashion show. Yeah, I want you to do it, but I'm doing a fashion show and I don't have no money to send a dress. Er, record scratch. This is my thing. I'm not mad because I understand things happen. But don't contact somebody telling them all what you're going to do and all what you're going to send. And when later down the line, you know. You can't do it or you can't afford it. Well, shit, if you can't afford it, well, this ain't the business you want to do then. Because when you're in the business of making things and selling things, you're going to have to ship things out to customers that pay their mean, 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 mean green, green machine. So if you ain't about that life, I think this ain't what you're trying to do, boo-boo. I really, I really think this ain't what you're trying to do. Um, Again, y'all. Because I know I'm going to have some people. You mad? No, no, bitch. I ain't mad. I'm just saying. Like, I do this all the time, so this shit don't bother me. But this is my thing. Don't email me wasting my time, wasting your time, where you could be doing whatever the hell you doing. I could be doing whatever the hell I'm doing. And you wasting my time. Like, don't, don't do that shit. Don't, my thing is, why you even contact me from the beginning to begin with? That's just what I want to know. And then I tell you, okay, that's fine. Because when I'm at a certain point and I don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck. Like, I don't care. So, I, I don't care. Don't email me. I'm going to send it. No, bitch. I don't want to do it. Send that shit to somebody else that give a fuck. Because I was trying to help your ass. But don't, don't try to play me. And then, as I'm thinking, I think the bitch trying to play me because y'all... These little mailers don't cost shit. You go to the damn Dollar Tree, they have them for a fucking dollar. And she could have bought one of these, put it in the damn mailer, and it wouldn't have been no more than three, four dollars in the regular USPS mail. So, bitch, don't try to play me. Don't, don't even do it. So, I'm at the point now, fuck it, fuck you, fuck that, fuck that dress, fuck all you stand for, whatever. I don't give a fuck. So, yeah, y'all, I know y'all like damn, but yeah, y'all. Tell me in the comment section below, y'all think I'm tripping, I'm overreacting, or, you know, what you think. What you would have did the same thing I did or what. Let me know, because y'all know I love conversing, not conversate. Hood ass, hood boppers, conversate with the sister. Let me know what you would have did or am I tripping or whatever, whatever. So, yeah, y'all, that's it. Later on today, I will be doing a makeup toot. So that makeup, t it will be for weeks from now, y'all see it. But I am going to film that and I'm going to film a, a accessory review from my cousin, Miss Tika Tenacia. She is a YouTube blogger as well. She does, excuse me, y'all. She does everything. She does makeup too. She know all that. 
So I'm gonna have her link in the fashion box below so you guys can go subscribe to her YouTube channel and also follow her on Instagram. And check out her page at tenacious.moonfruit.com. So yeah, y'all, that's it. I want y'all to do one thing for me. Stay fly, stay fashionable for less. Also, tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to my channel. Till next time, honey. Y'all know what I want you to do.